Welcome back to SNN and welcome into the 18th annual Dickie V Gala. Now, in between our interviews earlier, I talked to Enzo, one of the courageous kids. He came out looking fly, had the plaid suit on, had some Jordans on. But I think Mr. Wittenberg had to be like, I'm coming out here in my NC State Wolfpack duds. Got the red on, the beautiful shoes. <laughs> I tell you guys, Mr. Wittenberg, a legend in the game. Thank you for joining us. How are you feeling? I'm feeling tremendous. What what an opportunity tonight to, to be with Dick and his team and and to raise money for for cancer, especially pediatric cancer, to help these families and these kids. And uh, I've always I got such a, a, a admiration and 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 just love Dick Vitale so much and appreciate all he has done, not just for the V Foundation, for this community, and for the cancer world. Now, if we don't know Mr. Wittenberg, obviously 1983 national champion with Coach Jimmy V, Jim Valvano, and he put up the legendary pass. It wasn't a shot. If you're thinking at home, oh, that's the guy that I'm not even going to say it because it might be it's a curse word. We can't even say that word actually. So let's talk. This guy made a pass to Lorenzo Charles, dunked it home. Yes. So, and you also told me it stuck with me after you told me the other day. You're the only person to outscore MJ in every time you've met him in the game, right? Every time I played against MJ, I outscored him when I played in college, and uh, he was a sophomore. I was a senior, obviously. But the ACC was a great league and uh, great competition, and uh, enjoyed it playing against him. But uh, I think a lot of our ACC members have, have joined this fight. Uh, the coaches have helped the V Foundation, have helped Dick Vitale, and so we've all joined together as a team to fight this dreaded disease. And one of the originating board members of the V Foundation as well. Obviously, you're receiving the John Saunders Courage Spirit Award or Courage Award tonight. You and John went way back from what we talked earlier this week. You guys were part of the board as soon as it began. Obviously, your relationship with Jimmy V. What's it like tonight receiving the Saunders Courage Award? Wow, John Saunders what, is like a brother to me. Uh, we both were founding members. We were very, both were very close to Jim Valvano. And uh, John left us too soon. And uh, I thank Dick Vitale and his organization for keeping his legacy alive. He, he was great for ESPN, a great family man, and uh, really was passionate about uh, this organization, the V Foundation, and fighting cancer. And uh, I'm honored and humbled to receive the John Saunders Award tonight. In, in behalf of my family and NC State and all that have uh, been supporting me as well. And obviously you're still involved with NC State, Assistant Athletic Director, is that correct? Yes, Associate Athletic Director for Fundraising and Community Relations and Ambassador. And uh, it's good to be back in my alma mater, my hometown, and uh, just love the, the work that I do for the community, for our, for my school, and for the V Foundation. And what, what's the outlook for NC State moving forward? Tell me a little bit about what the Wolfpack's got going on. Oh, the Wolfpack's exciting. Our football, our, we just had two national champions in uh, cross country, and uh, uh, we're, we're doing great at NC State. Basketball is coming along, and uh, all of our sports. We have great spirit there, and uh, the future for NC State is bright. And one final question for you. Obviously, NBA playoffs are going on. If I'm correct, you were drafted by Phoenix, correct? I was drafted so is by that, Phoenix Suns. Is that who we're pulling for? Oh, yeah. I'm always pulling for Phoenix Suns. And my, one of my NC State uh, kids that I coach, TJ Warren, is with the Phoenix Suns. And, and K, uh, KD, Kevin Durant, is from the same hometown in Prince George's County that I'm from. So I'm going for uh, the Phoenix Suns to go all the way. All right. I appreciate you stopping by and taking the time. The flyest guy in the building, I tell you. Look at this. Perfect combo. Thank you again. We have more on the way right here on SNN from the Dickie V Gala. Don't go anywhere.